Here we're going to look at the power of immersive reader. Now Microsoft have done an amazing job in increasing accessibility for all and the immersive reader is a tool which is absolutely fantastic. So let's uh, have a look at how this works and the key to this video is to ensure that you know about immersive reader so that you can tell your students about it. Those particularly who have difficulty reading benefit from this amazing tool. So um, when we've made up our question, I'm going to go to preview here and it's question two I want to look at. So we can obviously read that we can see there's one point, but if you look down here at this uh, icon there, you can see immersive reader. If we click on immersive reader, this is what our students would want to do. They can see that the text format is changed and it's much more accessible to them. So the beauty of immersive reader is that it will read the uh, answer, the question and the answer to the students. So if I just press this. To where were the first modern Olympic games held? One point, New York, London, Paris, Athens, end of question. Close the reader to input your answer dot. So you can see that the question is read for the student. That was a little bit fast perhaps. So you can go down here to voice settings and you can change the speed. You can change male, female, and if necessary, you can come over here. The student can come over here. They can change the text size. They can uh, increase or decrease the spacing there. They can use different fonts. They can change the background if that's uh, more accessible to them. And their preferences are fabulous. There's many more things we can do with Immersive Reader, but just for now, I wanted to draw this to your attention so that you can show your students that this is something that they can make really good use of.